So we're home now, just got back from the market. And, uh, Lamachu Krung soup. It's a beef soup with lemongrass. Uh, we're on here, chopping the lemongrass right now. It's gonna be home food today. I don't know what they call this. This is they roast it over a uh, fire and then chop it up and put it over the soup. It's your water spinach from the market. Everything is super, super fresh over here. Some fish in the fry there. And beef. Leftover rice for the dogs. Beautiful dog she has. And there's a Tonday South River in front of us, back of the house. My wife said this is really good, I haven't tried yet, the lady, I pay her a thousand real extra, I feel bad for her. I always pay extra when I buy something, I tell them to keep the change, so I'm going to try this noodle right now. Mm. Oh my god. This is some good stuff. It's the sauce, the fish sauce from that um, the stall we bought in the market. Oh my God! This egg roll, uh, there's only carrots, onion, and uh, some kind of uh, white spore. It looks almost like a radish. I don't know the English name for it. And you have the pork fat, pork belly with, uh, with um, roasted ground rice and then they keep the mince, uh, cucumber, peanut oh my god the, the, the fish sauce she has is, is awesome wow mm. God, this is so good. Okay. I slug my cat, damn my cat, you do nothing. Oh, I slug it in your mother. Oh, I'm just tagging him that eye. But they got to hang your hand. And how I told you, don't look no sound. But they got to hang him and turn, mom. That's right. That's right. My aunt just had her, all her teeth removed for the last few of them, so she has to eat something really soft. Poor lady. It is so windy right now and I was advised not to stand uh, below the mango tree because 
they are falling off like crazy and it might hit you in the head. There it is. Here's the mango that just fall off the tree. You can eat them. I better get out of here quick. <laughs> oh man. They're so high. It's hard to pick them, almost impossible. So we're just gonna sit there. There's, there's hundreds of them. It's a windy season. And I was told this is a good eating mango. They're small, but they're very tasty. I'm gonna try it later. Ah, oh, you bad girl. Bad girl. This is a German uh, shepherd mix, four months old. Uh, his name is, her name is Coco. Beautiful dogs. And this guy is a purebred German shepherd. His name is Cooper. Cooper? Cooper? Oh, you're so cute. So cute, Cooper. Uh, you want some mango? Huh? You want some mango? You like mango? Oh man, don't lick my food, dude. That's my mango. Oh, you're so cute. So cute. And this looks um. Mm. I don't know what they call it in English, but it has a distinctive smell to it, and uh, it looks here with eggs, fries eggs. And this is the uh, lemongrass for the Samama Chu Krum. Look at that, eh? wife is cutting up the beef and she said the beef here is a little bit tougher than the, the steak that we uh, have in the US because I think this is a free roaming uh, cow that they use here they don't have a, a big farm like in the United States where animal are feed uh, uh, what you call those uh, hormone and uh, steroid uh, so this is all natural beef over here yeah they don't uh, I'm sure they do some feeder but most of the cow roam in the field eating grass naturally so yeah you're not gonna get uh, the farm uh, raised and uh, farm bread like back in the US where the cow just stay in one location and one spot and they keep feeding them with hormone and steroid and uh, unhealthy stuff so yeah the beef here the color you can tell it it's not it's kind of blackish it's not like the one in the United States so we can cutting up the beef to make uh, the soup sour soup some lama chu grill this one? No, This one? What is that? Uh, it's not, I don't know the name of that. This is, I you know this is Kalanga. It's a reddish. And then you have the ginger. You don't put ginger in here, but ginger, it's all uh, roots, uh, herbs. This is Kalanga. And another one my wife is holding. I don't know what you call this in English. 
This is Kalanga. No, this is Kalanga. This is Kalanga. Okay. Uh, this is tamarind. Oh, okay. This small red, uh, orange one is uh, tamarind. This is Kalanga. So you you put Kalanga with the soup. So not not this. This is going or something. That that. Yeah. Put a little bit of this too. Oh, okay. I'll let it do all the work. Preparation. It's a long one. Let it get box it up, man. Okay, I'll pound it for you. And this is a Cambodian cheese. It's a fermented fish called pang pang. So you always, they always add this to the soup. It's really smelly, but it's tasty once you add it to the soup. Add it with cream like this, and then you can cook it. Okay, so I've been pounding this too. Just add the the krum in there. Yeah, mix it. Making some lama two krum here in Cambodia. We fly seven something thousand miles, so we cook it. <laughs> Troublemaker, yeah. Coco. <laughs> She's so bad. She's like <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Here they come! Here they come! The gangster. Yeah. 
Mekah is around 300. Food is sour, like uh, tamarind, green tamarind or lemon. And if you see if the food is shredded like this, add fish, salt, chili, see if it's a grill or baked fish. And then you can use the leaf to put it into your beef. Some mama chew grilled soup. It's pretty neat, huh? You can eat up the whole tree. And we have uh, water spinach, which we... This is the last portion you put to the soup because they... They cook very fairly easy, and uh, you don't want to overcook uh, uh, water spinach. Water spinach. Just add water, it's boiling now, and then we'll just add the, uh, the water spinach later. <laughs> we just invited our uh, friend uh, Chana from Phnom Penh. She uh, rode her motorcycle over here from Phnom Penh for lunch to join us for lunch. Ni ba phinam ah? Ben. Ben chao mai. Trai? Bok nyam ba tai chien. Oh. Huh? Mai tham nyam cha ma mu nyom ma. So this is how you prepare the uh, tamarind. Cut it open like, like this and half and it remove the seed. That's what she's doing right now. Mm, just pound them up with chili. So we, we just un... We just pick a few uh, tamarind. Now we need some new Lebanon uh, herb for the soup. This tree? Can I hang? Oh. Gonna take this here to add to the soup, and we're right here on the river by taking, taking leaf for our soup. <laughs> oh man, so we come from this tree right here, and that's what we're gonna add to the soup. This is the leaf that we picked from the riverbank. We're gonna roast it over the fire and then put it in the soup. A little bit of salt here. Pepper, I think. Black pepper? No. What's that? Salt? Salt here are not very fine, like in the state. No, mm -hmm. too much. Probably too much. Yeah, yeah, that's good. And
Too much, too no, much. Too much. Yeah. The salt, uh, you have to uh, balance it out with salt. So a little bit more salt. Ah. And that's it. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. Too much. Ah. Yeah, love how much you already have. Should we try it? No, not bad. Oh, I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go